Let's add the fractions 3 fourths plus 7 eighths. And here's how we'll do it. When we're adding fractions, we want the denominators. We want to get those to be the same. Then we can just add the numerators and we'll have found the sum for 3 fourths plus 7 eighths. Why don't we do this? Why don't we multiply 2 times 4? Because 2 times 4 would equal 8. But we can't just multiply the denominator here. We also need to multiply the numerator. So 2 times 3. And that's because 2 divided by 2, that equals 1. We're just multiplying 3 fourths by 1. We don't change the value, just the way it's represented. Because now, 2 times 3 is 6. 2 times 4 is 8. We have 8. We have that denominator that's the same. So we'll add 7 eighths here. And when we add fractions, we keep the denominator the same. If these are the same, we can just keep that the same. 6 plus 7 that equals 13. So when we add 3 fourths plus 7 eighths, we get 13 eighths. This is an improper fraction. The numerator, it's larger than the denominator. So we could change it to a mixed number. 8 goes into 13 one time with 5 left over. We bring the 8 across. So 13 eighths, that does equal the mixed number 1 and 5 eighths. You can check that. 1 times 8, that's 8 plus 5. That gives us a 13. We just kept the 8 the same. Either way, this is Dr. B adding 3 fourths plus 7 eighths. You get 13 eighths, or as a mixed number, 1 and 5 eighths. Thanks for watching.